Here are two quick ways to change the pitch of the vocals in BandLab. Now to change the pitch of the whole vocal track, right mouse click on the whole vocal track, then move the mouse cursor over audio stretch on the pop-up menu, and then click on more on the pop-up menu. Now to change the pitch higher for your vocal track, click on the sharp icon, and to make the pitch of your vocals lower on the vocal track, click on the flat icon. And each time that you click on either the flat icon or the sharp icon, the pitch of the vocal track will be changed by one semitone. And a semitone is basically the same as one note, be it white or black, on a music keyboard. So I'm just going to put this five semitones higher. Now, if you want to hear what it sounds like, click on this gray bar here, just in front of the vocals on your vocal track. So if you click just before them, so this little red vertical marker line is just before the vocals, you can then click on the play icon to hear what the vocals now sound like. Set your heart upon the sea. And if you don't like the changes, you can click down here on revert changes and that will set this back to zero and the pitch change will be removed. And then you can close this by clicking on the X icon or click on apply. And now that's been added to your vocal track. And if you decide you don't want that change, you can just click on the undo icon and the pitch change will be removed. Set your heart upon the sea. Now, sometimes you just want to change one word or one phrase of your vocal track. So to do that, first I'm going to click on the zoom icon going a little bit closer to my vocal track and I want the second section here. So this is the bit that I want to change the pitch of. So if I go up here and click on the ruler and that will move this white vertical track position marker to the beginning of the section that I want to change. And I'll just check that that's the correct place. Okay, so that's where I want to start from. So now that I've got the white track position marker in the correct place, I can click on the vocal track then right mouse click on the vocal track and then click on slice. Now I'm going to click on the ruler again to move the white track position marker line to the end of the section that I want to change the pitch of, which is just here. I'm going to click on the track again, right mouse click on the track and then click on slice. So now if I click on the section I want to change the vocals of, so I've got that section highlighted and then right mouse click on that section and move the mouse over audio stretch and then click on more. And for this one I want to reduce the pitch by three semitones. Now unfortunately this audio stretch window if you press on the player it'll change the pitch of the whole track so there is a bit of a bug in this audio stretch window at the moment so I need to just press on apply and then I can check it out on the main screen. Break the chains and set me. And if it doesn't sound right, you can click on the undo icon and it will set it back to what it was before the pitch change. Set me 